A loaded gun found inside a Baltimore City school. It was quite a scare for students at Frederick Douglass High, but it was an unarmed officer who made sure everyone stayed safe. WJC's live Stetson Miller is at the school with how that officer jumped into action. Stetson. Hey Vic, that handgun was recovered today by city school police after they found that gun uh, on a student. Fortunately, nobody was hurt, but the police union says this could have ended a lot differently had officers and staff not acted quickly. Tense moments at a Baltimore City School. Police say a loaded handgun was carried into Frederick Douglass High School on Friday. They say the student hid the gun and brought it through the school metal detectors. The student was able to still conceal the weapon, um, and, and unfortunately, uh, he was able to penetrate uh, those uh, safety barriers. But city school police got information from a staff member about the firearm. That's when an officer acted quickly and took the student into custody. The weapon was never used to threaten anyone. It's the second time this year that there was an incident at Frederick Douglass involving a gun. Back in February, a special education assistant was shot by a man who was confronting the assistant about disciplining a family member. Parents say it's disturbing to know that someone once again brought a gun to the school. I'm glad that they recovered it and no one was hurt. Yeah, it's very upsetting. They need to beef up security or something. You could have hurt someone, kid, you right. know, or you could have hurt yourself. City school police tell WJZ since December 2016, there have been 26 firearms recovered from city schools. The debate over whether or not to arm city school officers during school hours has long been an ongoing debate. Sergeant Clyde Boatwright, who heads the school police officer union, says this latest incident is another example of why officers should be armed. But how many incidents do you have to see um, before you see that there's a need to have that omnipresence of a police officer it, as a deterrent? And Baltimore City Public Schools tell us that providing a safe learning environment is a top priority for them, and the student involved in this incident could face possible permanent expulsion. Live at Frederick Douglass High School, Stetson Miller for WJZ.